Hello Magic, and today we'll be playing a new game, and before we really continue on, let's turn the fucking sound down, because holy hell, that's blasting my ears. Okay. I think it should be good for now. So, this is the game called Toho Grimoire of the Elemental Castle. So, this is an RPG from what I remember uh, looking at. So, uh, just to note, this game was made by my homie, Dotlin. So, those who don't know, uh, Lin has been one of my subscribers and also he is an MMD creator from what I rem uh, from his old videos. I don't believe uh, Lin makes them now because you know I think uh, Lin just focuses on game creation now from what I understand. But anyway so this is the game they've been working on for a while and I'm pretty excited to try it out. Now when I download it's about like 333 megabytes so this should be a pretty lengthy game I think. Um, you know, bigger size of the game, the more content it would be. So yeah, um, this was made in an RPG maker. So that's the style. So you know, we're gonna be playing an RPG pretty much right off the bat. Now, if you see the characters right now, you see Tokiko and Reimu. So Tokiko will be the main character for this, and there are other characters I know who will be will be playing because I looked at some of the um, t early gameplay footage of this game. So I have a, I have a good feeling of who's gonna show up later. Uh, but I don't know the main plot of it anyway, so we'll see how this plays out, okay? Um, so this is an RPG maker game, um, you know, the layout will be very familiar to those who've played a lot of it. And I've covered a bit of them when it came to the fan game jam, so just to be wary of that. Okay, let's do this. A long time ago, a magician stumbled upon a little girl. Weak and all alone, she stood no chance of surviving in the wilderness. The magician took pity on her and decided to brought uh to brought to, it should be to bring the girl home with her, cause brought I don't know could be me. She nursed her to health and teached her everything the girl knows. Taught would be the correct one I think. Could be wrong. She promised her the world that she become the queen of the land, the mightiest person in the realm. And despite the odds, even when people turned against the magician, she fulfilled her promise. The girl now stood proud and tall inside of a magnificent castle, surrounded by lower knights in shining armor. But by then, uh, the magician no longer had the same care and loving eyes the, girls remember the girl remembered. The magician looked, locked her up in her castle, never to be seen again. Today, the queen wakes up from her deep slumber, not by the kiss of a prince, nor by the cry of her people, but because the words written on the door of her castle will finally be spoken. Alright, so that's the plot, at least what we're given so far. Skulls of a mansion gate. Okay, cool. What a nice weather we're having today. So if you can tell, they're using um the art style from... The, um, fuck, I remember... I. I can't remember the, the artist's name, but you know, the artist for Twilight Frontier, the one who did um, Immaterial to Hisu Tensoku, so that, that's the art style we're using. And you, you might have noticed it back in the intro, but yeah, that's the art style we're using for it. So just to take, uh, take note of that. No, no, no nodding off this early in the day. Hey, someone's coming this way. I guess? I had a feeling it's gonna be bad. I didn't expect it to be. It, it's gonna be this bad. Can't be helped having not only Marissa but also Flandre rampaging around in here. Well, have fun cleaning, Kokuma. Perpetually, Summer. Stop whining. It's part of your duty. Ugh. Whoa. What a mess. What happened here? And who might you be? The library isn't open for public. Please leave. Oh no, Patrick Lisama, this is the girl I've told told you about. I'm Tokyo, I'll be working part-time uh, starting today. You're Kokuma's master, right? Patrick knowledge, right? Nice to finally meet you. Huh? Well you arrive at the perfect time. Kokuma can use this can use some hand. Go and clean this mess up. Straight to the point I see. Aren't you here to work? Now get moving now. Uh chop chop. Alright, alright, leave it to me. Girls are cleaning. Woo! Koa, I've cleaned up all the debris. 
Thank you for your hard work. The master of yours sure is something else, isn't she? I mean, she had me read and sign these contract papers while I was moving around stuff. Uh, just look at how ridiculous these are. <laughs> she can be a bit quirky sometimes. Even I'm not used to all of her antics. Just go along with her whims and you'll do fine. Say, so how are you doing over there? About halfway there, I'm still sorting out the books. The damaged books needs to go to on a restoration work before going back to the shelves, see? I guess the restoration work also falls on you? Pretty much. That's rough. That's okay, I'm used to it. Then anything I can do to help? Well, I put all the books that aren't damaged on the table. Can you put them on the shelves? Leave it to me. Thanks, there's a label on each shelf. Uh, just put them there according to the titles. Koa, what's wrong? I can't even read a single word on these. These aren't even letters. Oh, you're right. These ones are all written in a special rune language. I suppose you can't help with them then. That's okay, go ahead and take a break, Tokiko-san. Hmm. Do you have any sort of dictionary for this rune language? Uh, um, no. I don't think so. Actually, there is an old notebook that I used to write down stuff when Pachi sama taught me this language. That's the closest thing I have, I suppose. That'll do. Where is it now? I kept it in my room. Want me to go and get it? Here you go. Not sure how this would help, though. Thanks! Don't beat yourself up if you don't understand it right away. I mean, it took me a few months to learn how to interpret the symbols and... Wait, what are you doing exactly, Sokiko-san? You're just flipping through the pages. Alright, I'm done. There you go, thanks. Back to work, back to work. Uh, what What do you mean by done? Basis of the seven elements. Breakthrough about alchemy. Effects of environmental changes on nature spirits. The Great Witch Hunt. Enter the mine. Illusions and hypnotism. Bushido in the bedroom? Oh, it's about practicing sword fight techniques for confined space battles, of course. Right, I'll be taking these to the shelf. Sorry to interrupt your work. Eh? Oh, do you have to press it? Okay, I wasn't too sure. Eh? I'm back. W what was that just now? What? All you did was flip through my notes and. Ah, oh, that. Ah, ha ha. That's a special ability of mine. R really? I know, I know. Those are those with. There are those with cool abilities like manipulating darkness or reading minds. And I'm stuck with this the ability to understand written concept. Um, I'm trying to think. As far as I'm wary, I don't believe Tokyo has was ever. I don't think we've. Obviously, in canon, I don't think that's, we've ever stated her abilities. Hell, we don't even have her full name! Her legit name! This is the fan name after all, still. So, you know. Um. So I think that's just the ability given for this game. I'm pretty confident Tokyo has no written ability as of yet that we are wary of. Basically, if it's written, I can understand it. And if it's within the scope of my strength, I can use it. That? That sounds like a dream come true. Not really. If the subject's too difficult, my head hurts. If it took away all the fun of reading a new story because I can understand it just by glancing. And it doesn't even work when I can't read in the first place. Lame, right? Well, when you put it that way, it sure comes with a price, huh? Anyway, I don't really use it that often. I want to enjoy books like a normal person too. Right, I understand. Alright then, I'll be bringing the books to my room next start, uh, and start working on them. Tokiko-san, can you help me carry them? Tokiko-san? Oh, sorry, I wasn't paying attention. I just noticed that... That thing looked a bit out of place. What is that? That? To tell you the truth, I don't know. That's the one area in the library that is off limit, even for me. Really? Wow. That looks like it was a powerful seal too. Patrick is serious about not letting anyone inside there, huh? That's right, I know anyone other than Patrick and Sabah can remove the seal. Don't you think it's odd that she doesn't trust you enough to let you in there? Wait, th th that she doesn't trust you enough to let you let you in there? Okay, that's a little off. I suppose so, then again, I'm not in the position to question her on that kind of decision. So what do you think is inside? Treasures? Ancient books? Secret hobby room? I don't know, passionately, I mean, probably something really precious to her. Wait, why are you asking the, uh, these Tokiko-san? Eh, that wasn't me. Eh? That explains, I was wondering why I didn't see Tokiko's sprite. Marissa? Since when? Good thing I brought this then. Raymu special, Chi-Chi, unlock anything charm. 
I mean, she does, Raymond does have the ability to unseal anything she wants. I don't know if it was like a special cheat sheet, but sure. No barrier sick can or at least that's what she said. Stop, please. Uh, why should it? It's for the sake of knowledge and science and peace and love. That doesn't even make sense. Why should it? Come on, the world needs to know Patrick's dirty secrets. Wow, it works like a charm. Well, I guess it was a charm. <laughs> Just stop. No one step further. Not listening. Love sign. Master. Kokuma. Spark. Tokyo-san. Oh, I was wondering who new face is. It's the bird from way back then. But the shield's gone now. Treasures, here I come. Ah, no, wait! Sorry, Tokyo-san. I have to stop her. Wow, this looks valuable, Z. Eh, it's sealed as well. I can't open it. <laughs> I don't have another charm with me. Oh, well, I'll just borrow another one from Reimu. Stop right there. Ah, oh, good. The librarian's here. Say, I'll be borrowing this for a bit. You won't mind, right? No, I do mind. Put that grimoire down. Or, or what? You're gonna shoot me, Z? Just give it up. You're way below my lead, Kokuma. Eh! See, not even close. Ugh. No, keep it together, Kokuma. You need to buy it sometime until Patchy Summer. I guess it's my turn to attack, right? Love sign? Why you? Eh? You filthy, arrogant thief. Yeah! My head, my head! Ugh. Ugh. Tokyo san Get my headers! How did Kane Sensei manage to butt butt the kids all the time? Attacking from behind is not fair. Are you both okay? Please tell me there's no brain damage. Go and grab the book. Hurry! We're right! Eh. I'm guessing that's the overworld? The evil queen has been awakened. Alright. Yeah.